Today I'll be filming this look as you as you can see right here. So as you can tell, background, eyeshadow, shirt. We're in the spring vibe, so I wanted to do something colorful for you guys. Um, without further ado, if you want to see how I got this look, go ahead and continue watching. And I hope you guys enjoy. Alrighty guys, I'm taking my Morphe 35B palette and we're going to take this baby blue shade right here. <clears throat> I already prepped and primed my eyes, so we're just going to go ahead and we're going to jump right in. Taking that baby blue shade and we're going to put this into our crease as our transition shade. So you want to go ahead and you want to keep on building that color up until you get the color and the pigmentation that you're needing. Getting a clean fluffy blending brush and we're just going to blend out the edges making sure that everything is nice and blended. So now I'm going in with this Juvia's um, Place palette, the Masquerade palette, and I just took that shimmer um, shadow, the blue one, it's called Delila, D Dahlia, I think that's how you pronounce it, and I know it's shimmer, but we're just going to add this into the crease, just so that we can give it some more pigmentation and more color. Going back in with the 35B palette from Morphe, we're going to to add this navy blue shade into the crease as well. So you're just wanting to really blend those shadows out, especially the shimmer one. That's why we put the navy blue on top. So that you won't have any shimmers trans uh, transferring transferring. Sorry. Now taking that baby blue shade, and we're just going to put this above the crease, just so that we can blend out the sh the shadows that we just applied. So you want to just take a clean blending brush and just keep on blending, just making sure that there's no harsh edges at all and making sure that everything is nicely blended. Now taking my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer and we are going to cut our crease. So I'm just going step by step. You just want to really focus on getting that sharp crease. Now taking my next glitter glue and my teal glitter and we're just going to apply the glitter glue and then we're going to go ahead and apply the glitter in just a minute. So where we cut the crease is where you're going to apply that glitter. Now applying this glitter from BoltGlitters.com and it's in the shade teal.
Now taking this white NYX liquid liner and we're just going to apply this on the crease line and bear with me guys, this liner sucks ass. So if you, anyone knows any white liners that are liquid, liquid liners and brush tips, please let me know. I did my foundation off camera so we're just going to start with our Physicians Formula Butter Bronzer and we're going to bronze our face. You just want to keep snatch those cheekbones. Don't forget your forehead and your nose as well. This bronzer is really good. You can also use it as a light contour for your face. Now taking this Milani Rose Blush and we're just going to apply it into our contour as well. Now taking our Aurora highlighting palette and we're going to just take the lightest shade out of the palette um, I don't have it in front of me but I will list it down below it's the name of the, sh the highlighter that I used <laughs> this highlighter is phenomenal like oh my god final look this is how everything turned out sorry about the crappy liner this liner fucking sucks if you guys know any good white liquid brush tip liners please let me know because the next liner suck ass anyways um moving on for that from that um this is what i came up with this is what I filmed for you guys because I haven't obviously filmed in a week. So, this is what I filmed for you guys. Um, other than that, I hope you beauties enjoyed. As usual, I have everything listed down below in the description box. If you have any video requests, anything like that, any questions, go ahead and leave them down for me in the um, comment box and I'll get back to you guys. Other than that, I hope you really enjoyed this tutorial. And yeah, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Till then.